Hey family, welcome back to my channel. It's the Pisces way, a place for a Pisces rain, just for a Pisces sun, moon, and rising. And you already know it's your girl, Harpy Sis Mar. And you already know how we do. So sit back and relax, and we're definitely going to get the tea for the Pisces. Okay, cross markets are definitely welcome. Let's go right in and see what is going on, family. Let's sip the tea. Let's do a quick prayer first. Higher power, archangels, ancestors, gods, and goddesses of the divine white light. Please protect me and my family as we dip into this read. Please protect our energy from any unwanted souls, vibes, or entities. Please give us the clarity and the truth. Please surround us with your love and guide us with your wisdom, always and forever. Higher power, archangels, ancestors of the divine white light. Showing gratitude and thanks for all the blessings, the lessons, the seasons, and new beginnings. For you delivering us away from temptation. Guiding us throughout our journey to the motherland of milk and honey. Forever grateful for your divine protection and love. Amen. Now with, mm, now with that being said, let's tap in, family. <laughs> I'm getting a little choked up here. I'm getting like somebody could definitely be trying to block your throat chakra. We got phone tag coming out here. Okay, somebody wants somebody to rather shut up or not do something. I'm hearing stop with all that nonsense. There's an older um, feminine energy here that's in your energy, uh, Pisces. I'm hearing this woman could be in masculine energy or she she knows a masculine or you could be masculine okay take it however it resonate here somebody could want you to be quiet or stop talking or stop whatever is you doing it's, it's giving me like when your grandmama or somebody is like when you fooling around or playing around it's like stop with all that carrying on and all that da, 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 da. But this is giving me like something somebody's saying. Somebody could also be trying to out talk somebody. Uh, somebody could be getting mad or feeling intimidated. Okay. Feeling a little heated in the morning. Moment. Moaning. Heated in the morning. So I'm getting like somebody could um, be feeling like there's going to be like some type of sexual favors or something sexual that's going on. And they don't, they don't sit right with them. Whether this is an older woman, older than you, or this is like somebody's grandmother or something like that, or mom or auntie. <coughs> it's giving an energy of an older woman, but they could definitely be like somebody that's just older than you, but they act older. Okay? But this could be like an old lady as well. Um, but like, say, for instance, you don't, you know, make love with somebody or have sex here or something like that. Um, are you dead or you want to or something like that? You can even be saying stuff about an individual that you like about them. Some type of sexual desires or sexual fantasies here. Somebody can be like, stop with all that carrying on. Stop with all that gossip. Stop with all that nonsense here. I'm getting like this person is low-key just kind of jealous. Somebody's low-key kind of jealous. Um, they're kind of envious. And I keep, um, I'm getting like you brushing it off. Low Pisces. Okay, whether this could be about a masculine energy or this is um, your masculine energy or it's something like that here. I get, I feel like this is an older feminine and I said masculine energy. So, I don't know, or this person could be in masculine energy here. But there is some type of phone tag um, messages going back and forth here. You are definitely not it 100%. Fooly, fooly with the toolie coming out in the reverse. So, that right there is giving me like somebody d got their defenses down. Like something kind of caught somebody off guard here. Somebody wasn't expecting something here. Somebody, um, like this kind of like was a shocker. Um, I'm also getting like this could be somebody who's not really into violence or gun violence. Um, or just unprotected here. Did not have a guard up. Yeah, trust is earned. Come out in the reverse. Yes, yeah, somebody here trusted somebody way too much. Are you trusting this this woman way too much? Or an individual, somebody that you're talking to, you're trusting them way too much. Do I look like Bob the Builder? I'm getting like somebody here don't really give a fuck about your problems or your situations or whatever it is that you're talking to talking to them about like seven instances you're like um i'm having these problems i'm having this and that and that going on they don't really give a fuck about what you got going on somebody do 
want do somebody do give a fuck though they do want to know your business i should have put a lemon in my tea oh i think i'm gonna go put a lemon in my tea somebody do want to know what the fuck you got going on though um healing play on your own playground open closet so somebody wants you to open up to them about your healing or have a discussion with them about it. it's like you're telling them things that they really don't want to hear they want to hear the good stuff the juicy stuff the gossip the tea they don't want to hear about who you love or who you care about or a phone tag or calling somebody or something like that or who you feel like is not the one for you and who you could care less about somebody really don't give a fuck about your emotions or feelings and this could also be an older masculine as well too so just take it however it may resonate. Uh, but with that play on your own playground, I feel like you are somebody you are very closed off. You're doing things very discreetly. You keep it to yourself here. Um, you're minding your own business, okay? And with that open closet in the reverse, I feel like you're not telling nobody shit, okay? The things that, that you're doing, you're moving discreetly as far as, like, how you're healing, when you're healing, when you're choosing to heal, it, to heal. Um, don't cool, it's trip. I mean, ooh, don't cool, it's trip. <laughs> Why is that in reverse? Don't cool. It's trip. Somebody's trying to rewind back time or something. I feel like somebody's trying to rewind back time. Somebody's trying to do some type of reverse psychology. Okay? Cookie crumble. I'm getting like, you could be letting a cookie crumble wherever they may fall. Like, you letting things happen the way it's supposed to. But somebody's trying to do some type of reverse psychology. They could also be trying to come up with some type of master plan or shake your your intelligence. Okay. Somebody could be dealing with a Taurus. Alien. Somebody could be out from outer space here. Somebody could be very unique. Okay. Are you got Taurus in your background here? Can't turn a hoe into a house fire. Uh, oh. Damn. Can't turn a hoe into a house fly. Somebody is a fucking monitoring spirit or somebody sending out monitoring spirits in the form of flies, bro. Can't turn a hoe into a house fly. I feel like this whoever this woman is is projecting energy through house flies. They're sending gnats and little irritating ass bugs like bees or whatever. Um, are just like critters, like mouse, roaches. They, they're, they're sending this weird ass energy through bugs and instincts. Like they're sending this towards you. Okay. For some of y'all, it's flies. For some of y'all, it's like rodents. Like if you're seeing like possums, raccoons, you're seeing like animals echo weird or act a certain kind of way towards you. Um, I'm hearing alley rats. You like might literally see like a um, you might literally see like a rat in the alley, or uh, um, for some of you guys, you might even you know it is around the winter time. Um, some people you know you might see a mouse. Not saying that your you your house is nasty or whatever, but like because they're sending this type of energy, they want these rodents to like come at you to make you uneasy, make you bothered. Okay, even like roaches, you can keep your house squeaky clean. And next thing you know, you see a fucking fly or you see some shit. Like, where the fuck did that come from? It's a monitoring spirit. They're sending like, and and not only that, but they could be sending the image of it as well. Like, you might have thought you seen something wrong past and it really wasn't that. It's just that these motherfuckers are sending out these, these entities or whatever. Like, you might have thought you seen a, a roach or something, but it's not. You might have thought you seen this and that and that but it's not you feel me like somebody here is um playing a very weird ass game yep man who i just love y'all i love when higher power do that reverse psychology and so i'm getting like now what is what is they trying to do like okay what is the somebody's thinking of some type of master plan they're trying to <clears throat> don't trip though i feel like you you really un you really unbothered at this point though whoever you are you really are unbothered you're really unfazed here what is this scorpio there this is a motherfucking scorpio or scorpio is out here significant out of this world 
a Scorpio could feel like you're out of this world or you feel like this about a Scorpio Pisces. Um, somebody can have Scorpio highly aspected. We got Aries energy as well at the bottom of the deck. What up, what's, what's, what's up about this? We got hair done, nail done, everything did. <coughs> so you out here looking good. This Scorpio energy looking good here. Or Scorpio feel like you looking good. You know what? Download energy. Somebody's getting downloads here. Red-handed. Somebody's been caught red-handed. My ears, my ears ringing. Somebody's being caught red-handed by the downloads you're getting here. You're seeing things for what it is. Okay. Are 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 you having some type of realizations? Like your 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 consciousness is like connecting two and two. Things are being put together here. Actions takes courage. Okay. Keep looking back in the reverse. Somebody is not looking back and they're pushing forward. Fuck that. Somebody's like, I need to take action here. Okay. I need to take action. Baby got back and I'm trying to relax. Somebody feels like you look good. No green eggs and ham. Yeah, somebody said no, nah, I am. We gotta make it public then coming out in the reverse. So I'm getting like this could be some type of insider. This is like keep it between me and you. Yeah. <clears throat> Somebody's also comparing two people. Like the difference between me and you. This could be a man that's trying to compare another man. Like if you if like if you're somebody where you're dealing with a man that's trying to compare or compete with you over a female, this man is like sending like psych, uh, psychological abuse or psychological negativity trauma to your um, crown chakra at this time with this no green eggs and ham. That's that no green eggs and ham. No green eggs and ham. Sam I am. But at the end of the fucking story, what did he end up eating? That motherfucking green eggs and ham. Somebody's trying to get you to reject something that you're going to like after all here. Somebody's trying to... Okay, so we see what's going on here. Somebody's trying to um, get somebody to turn you down. It's, it's kind of like pin two people against each other. It's like, oh, if I can't pin one against the other, then I'm going um, to I'm gonna use psychological abuse. I'm going to pinpoint them with trauma. I'm going to pinpoint them with, tru uh, with truth. Healing, Capricorn energy, okay? Somebody could be healing from a Capricorn or a Capricorn here is healing. Or you got a Capricorn highly aspected in your chart here. Yeah, I'm here in reverse psychology. Some of you guys, this shit is not really penetrating you, okay? You were warned. Somebody was warned about doing this shit and they keep doing it here. They keep trying to get over. They keep trying to, I'm here, slut me out. Slut me out. Somebody here want to, um, they want to have... They want to have sex here, but it's like a different kind of sex. Yeah, we got ego death in the reverse, and we got nose in the air. So, somebody could be acting real stuck up. They want to, like, if you made this person have, like, an ego death to the point where, like, they feel insecure about themselves, they feel down, they feel ugly, they feel mean, they feel uninspired here. They want to reverse psychology. They want to make you feel that way here. They also want you to reject somebody that's coming towards you or reject somebody that is good for you that you could be keeping your eye on or wanting to step forward. And the reason that they're doing this is because somebody's actually breaking through and wanting to be with you or come. So it's like somebody wants to come and be with somebody, right? And somebody here is using reverse psychology. But there's also a masculine that's in the background here that's comparing. They're saying the difference between me and you I would never love her. I would never trust her. I'm telling you that the difference between me and you, like somebody is like, um, saying, basically trying to say like this woman's a gold digger. <coughs> She's a Jezebel spirit, basically. So I'm getting like two people sending out negative ass energy. Um, and then we also got like, um, a woman that's trying to get another woman to turn a man down. I'm here, mama, 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 I just shot a man down. Yeah, Rihanna energy. Somebody wants you to hurt this person's feelings. 
somebody wants you to uh be in regret. It's like it's like you cut somebody out, hurt their feelings, you know, spit on their pride, and like this person like hate you. Like, ugh, I can't stand that B word. Somebody's trying to get you to be like the queen of swords are being this very negative energy so that you can like kind of you know fuck somebody feelings up, hurt them really bad, shit on them, talk about them. Um, you know, and the reason why they're trying to do this is because they want they don't want this person to come towards you. What they really want is for this man to have sex with them and slut them out. Because, see, you made somebody have an ego death, okay? And they feel like your nose is in the air. They feel like your nose is in the air. Yeah, and then it's crazy because I just look down and I see uh, weird and proud 100%. So, some of you guys, you accept your downfalls. You accept who you are. You know, you know, whoever you, you know, whatever your flaws may be, you accept that shit and you still beautiful and you know you're beautiful. You don't give a fuck what somebody do or what they say, okay? You know who you are at the end of the night, you know what you bring home, you know, you know, your ego is like in the air. But I'm getting like, it's in the air, but it's not like how they're making it seem. They're making it seem like you're just this snobby ass bitch. No. That's not what it is. You're confident, okay? Everybody out here got a flaw. Everybody got here out here got some shit that somebody can point out and talk about. Okay, boo-hoo-hoo. Next, okay, you're somebody where you're like, okay, so what? And because I'm getting like, they can point out about two, three things that they can see visibly wrong with you, baby. And you own that shit, eat that shit, go to sleep at night, wake up in the morning, be beautiful all over again. But you can point out about fucking 10 things on them that's ugly, busted, rusted, and disgusted. And they gonna go to sleep and be crying at night. Like, you know what? That bitch was right. <laughs> that, that's, that's what that's about. But, like, somebody keep trying to come for you, though. And they're sending out this negative energy. They're sending out through different people. They want you to lash out on people. They want you to be insecure. They want you to be argumentative. They want you to be all this shit. Yeah. I wish you the best love. Okay, baby. Peace. Peace. I wish you the best love. Like, get on with that bullshit. Because at the end of the day, you still love yourself and you're going to sleep good at night. Okay? Like, somebody's a real weirdo. Apple's Apple don't fall, don't fall too far from the tree. Ooh, what's that? What's going on here? It, it's happening all around you. Look outside. But some of you guys, this could be somebody in your family or somebody in your family here is not to be trusted. Honestly, I wasn't thinking. Honestly, I wasn't thinking. Somebody here, you need to um, cover your bases. Dot your eyes and cross your T's. Because at the end of the day, it's like you need to cover your tracks, baby. Because it's like somebody is like coming behind you and trying to pick up the pieces. They could also be rearranging your words. Okay, somebody's words are slurred. Somebody could be drunk. So they could be waiting till you're like drunk or intoxicated or when you're not at your right state of mind here. Like catching you when you're vulnerable or catching you when you're feeling Catching you when you feel targeted or pressured here and trying to rearrange your words. There could be children or younger adults that's involved in this. What is this apple don't fall too far from the tree? I'm also getting like, you could be aware of people and scammers. I'm here to be aware of scammers. I don't know, that's for somebody. Big hand, little hand. I'm getting like the person who don't ask for much is the one who with the big hand. The motherfucker that don't talk and run their mouth too much is the one who has the bigger hand, has the upper on all this shit. It's the little, you know how they, like the little chihuahua that bark and run their mouth and talk a whole lot. But all in reality, they just little as fuck. They really don't have no power. They really don't have no aggression. They really don't have shit behind them. They really don't have shit to stand for. It's like somebody's all talk, nobody. Like, period. Somebody's all talk, nobody. Like, I'm getting like the one that's actually new. You ain't never seen... Where somebody keep picking with somebody, somebody keep picking with somebody, and it's like somebody's still quiet. But it's like they running their mouth, they putting their hands. I, I'm even getting a video that I seen a while back on Facebook when it's like the girl running her mouth, pointing at this girl, talking about this girl, you know, bullying this girl. And that girl just standing there quiet, not saying nothing. 
waiting on that girl to touch her. And the time she touch her, she tear her ass up. It's giving something like that. Like, I feel like somebody can't take it. Somebody can't take it and they really want to backfire or they really want to do something about it. And they keep reversing to this. No. <laughs> they keep reversing to this reverse psychology or they keep reversing to this magic here. Because they feel like they can't get one up on you. Like, if this person could get you in your feelings, if this person could get you to laugh out, if this person could get you to be mad, if this person could get you to cry, break down, be insecure, it will make their day. It literally will make this person's day. Like, they'll go home so happy. A fucking Scorpio. Or who the fuck is this? Lazy day in bed. It's a Scorpio. Or you got Scorpio in your energy. Scorpio is out here twice. Watch until the cookie crumble, but it's coming out in reverse. There, I, I just really feel like, I want to see, we're going to clarify this Scorpio energy. Blockages in the reverse, I can't make it up. Change of plans in the reverse, some of y'all young and dumb. Somebody is young and dumb and stupid, young, dumb, full of cum. <coughs> Somebody just want to... Ooh, I feel like, I feel like with this energy, I'm also getting like, somebody's not thinking. They're not thinking. They're thinking small. Like, they're thinking, this is like letting envy and jealousy and rage get the best of you. It's like how a saying like, you're acting like a very immature person. Even if you're older, you're acting very immature. It's like, take your, let bygones be bygones. Take your shit and go on, on on your way. But somebody's like, no, no, I still got to get one up. No, I still got to be da -da 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 -da. No, but I'm getting like somebody's not changing their plans. Something is not. And, and what's going to happen is the more somebody play with magic or the more somebody study does something here, it's just going to keep backfiring because and it's like, it is not going to end good. We got twisted with a skirt on. I'm telling you, twisted with a skirt on. Somebody feel like you got them fucked up. Like, you got me twisted with a Like, you got me fucked up. You got me fucked up, like, fool. <laughs> and you know what? This little saying is coming from my dad. <laughs> Shout out to my dad. So, I'm really feeling like this is a man twisted with a skirt on. Because, you know, like, somebody could be a little bisexual. Or, or want to be a little bi curious. I don't know. Not my dad, but I'm getting like, whenever he would say that, like twisted with a skirt on, like, I never wear a skirt. You got me twisted with a skirt on. You feel me? And I'm getting like, somebody like, you got them twisted with a skirt on. Yeah. But actually, it's coming out in reverse. So they actually all fucked up. But they feel like you got them fucked up, though. Walking with lions, it's coming out in reverse. Somebody's not protected here. Sagittarius energy. Somebody's not protected. But you are. Maybe they don't truly feel like you're protected. Maybe they don't truly feel like you have the power within you. Maybe they don't truly feel like hey, power got your back. You know how somebody keeps going through certain shit in their life and they like are kind of in denial. Like I'm not getting karma because of them. I'm not getting karma because of them. I'm not getting karma because of them. But it's like every time they do something, it's immediate karma. Like that shit immediately backfire. And we got Aquarius. And my dad's an Aquarius. I really feel like this is a man we talking about. This man could be a father figure. Let's get the Kipper. Let's see something here. And then I'm going to pull these index cards back out. Cause those just kind of went hard real quick. <clears throat> yeah, I'm hearing that shit again. The difference between me and you. I, I would never love her. I would never trust her. I'm telling you that the difference between me and you. Just, somebody could be saying somebody holding out their hand or something. Look, sudden wealth and journey. Like, if somebody's, like, a wealthy man or they got, like, some type of expectations, they could be saying, like, this woman a gold digger or something. Man, I just seen many male false person. Give me something for this 
Scorpio, what is this here? Is this, you know, somebody dealing with Pisces? Is this somebody in Pisces energy? What is this Scorpio here? We got courthouse coming out crossing. Ooh, a cross on the floor here. We got adjudication. Oh, when the lights go out. When the lights go out and I'm in my bed, I think of all the memories inside my head, all of the things that I did back then. Oh, when I'm in my bed. Somebody here is thinking about you and how they did you wrong or how they hurt you. We got adjudication here. Or I'm hearing army fatigue here. So I feel like with the courthouse, the official person and adjudication, somebody is definitely going to court. Court. Somebody is definitely, um, somebody can play basketball. Somebody is definitely um, in some type of pursuit of happiness, lawsuit, energy, expectation, income, circumstances, monumental, message of concern, and distance. Somebody is getting like some type. Okay, so there could be somebody who's like afraid of somebody taking them to court here. Um, they're reminiscing on like whether how they did you wrong or like mistakes that they made here, things that they wish that they could take back but they can't. A child could be significant here. Message of concern. Somebody's gonna travel though, or somebody's <coughs> finding out in the distant horizon about going to court adjudication being in court or they they ask yes yeah, somebody got a lawsuit or somebody's being sued yeah a main male lovers and house so whether a main male is suing somebody for some type of property damage or property real estate marriage lovers property mature man and house Somebody could be like a real estate agent. Somebody could have went through this. Scorpio could have went through like a battle here. Or a war or some sort. Or. Because we got courthouse coming out crossing. Ownership. Somebody said take ownership. Somebody finna have to take ownership for what the fuck they did here. I feel like somebody's dragging a Scorpio to court. I really feel like that. A main male could be dragging a Scorpio to court. Because we got a courthouse coming out across the adjudication. This could be a couple, though. There's somebody else here. They're not coming out here. Thoughts. Message of concern. And I'm feeling like they have had to travel a distance to go to court. Who, who is getting this message of concern? <coughs> Somebody that's in regret with the Five of Cups. Somebody that's in regret is getting some type of message of concern that something's going on at a distance here. Whether these are, yeah, this is unexpected. And we got King of Pentacles. Being caught off guard here, two of cups. Coming out some type of... I feel like there's a king of... There's a man that's finna get a lot of money for taking some people to court. Who is this people... Yep, yeah, look. Nine of cups. I can't make it up. Gift. Who is this... Um, Who is these people here that's going to court hard for? Because it's like in some type of transition. Meaning like this hasn't happened yet. But this is happening away from wherever somebody is. So it's like not by a person. But it's like it's that it's finna hit their ass. I can't make it up. High priestess. Okay. Somebody not finna be celebrating. Yup. And they feelings. <coughs> Heartbroken. Somebody's intuition is telling them that there's some type of giving and receiving going on. Or there's something going on here. This could be this main male. This main male could be like a high priestess, higher fin type of energy. And their intuition could have been telling them something about some type of giving and receiving, some type of going back and forth. 
um, and whoever that they are like suing or, or bringing into court, they finna bring that other person into court too. It's like two people. And, 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 and then you know, it's like one person is not, but somebody noticed. I'm hearing hind legs, something about a dog, something about a gift. It's like a dog standing on two legs here, doing some type of trick. I'm hearing reversal magic, reversal spells. Somebody's trying to reverse something here. Somebody's trying to get that monkey off their back or they're trying to go to the same people that they reached out to 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 pull this energy or to summon whatever this is or to do whatever this shit is they're trying to have that go back here because they finna get karma um but the thing about it is it's too late give me something for this high priestess who is this high priestess <laughs> they are the high priestess Cards keep falling on the floor. This is somebody who was in like some type of toxic ass marriage. Okay. And has broken out free from this shit. And they're firm on it. Like they're absolutely positively done with something. It's like I'm I'm absolutely done. I'm walking away. This was like a, um, a a vicious cycle being ended out here. Yeah, somebody could possibly not like a woman here. And um, somebody could be rejecting the individual. But the thing about it is somebody not taking no for an answer. Somebody keeps harassing somebody or something like that. So this man, whoever this man is, I feel like this is a man. So I thought that there was some type of giving and receiving. Maybe they didn't know who this other man was, or maybe they did find out, and it could have hurt them. But their intuition is very strong. Very Somebody has these spiritual gifts, okay? Somebody's very intuitive with the high priestess come out in the upright here. They finna drag a person into court, and they finna drag this other person into court too. It's like, yeah, yep, five of wands. I feel like <coughs> there's going to be like an argument, even like a physical fight about these people going into court. This can even be more than one person. This can even be up to like three people. And with the King of Pentacles being caught off guard here, I feel like this is not even a King of Pentacles. I feel like somebody is being caught off guard by this man bossing up and getting this money. So that whatever this lawsuit is or whatever this court situation is, this is gonna go through. Okay. Then like um I feel like somebody here again, because the three of wands is like unexpected and caught off guard with the seven of wands. It's like somebody got their defenses down here. Somebody could be being vulnerable. So maybe they didn't expect this man to be vulnerable to a two of cups here and coming out of some type of five of swords. So there was an individual who was in the five of swords here, but they're coming out like somebody is seeing shit for what it is. Somebody is realizing something or it's their damn intuition. It's connecting the dots. When it comes to like, man, somebody feels like they have no choice. They keep getting information, new information, or they keep finding out shit here. Eight of Cups, what's that behind me? Temperance. Somebody's finding out the reason why somebody won't leave them the fuck alone. Wow. Because, see, they're not giving energy to whoever this is. I feel like this is a woman. So if there's a woman that's holding on to a man, she he, this man could be finding out news or getting some type of clear information that the reason why this woman won't leave him alone or walk away from there or keep trying to come towards them is because this woman wants some money from them. She can know that this man is going to be the the the, ten, the uh, king of pentacles here. She know that this man is going to win some type of lawsuit. I'm hearing dragged into court. Is this man dragging this woman into court? That's holding on to his energy. Is this man dragging this woman into court? A motherfucking thief. I feel like whether this is going to be found out on the stand or this man already knows. He's been doing his research and he knows that this woman has some type of intentions or motive to try to steal. Mm. 
He know that this woman has some type of intentions to steal from him or to take from him. She know, uh, oh, she know about. What's that? What's that? She know about. Golf is that he know about. She know about. What she, what she know about? What was that? Ten of swords. Ending. Caught off guard. Unbalanced. She knows something. And she not healed about it. She fucked up about it. She know he know. She know he know about everything. The ten of swords. The being cut off. Uh, cut off? Ooh, cut off? I was going to say caught off guard. Emperor in the reverse. Or this is like caught off guard. Boundaries being let down. <laughs> it's like keeping some type of cycle. They're losing your beat here. And like falling on your face. They wanted this man to fall on his face. They wanted this man to be the emperor in reverse. They wanted this man to be the king of swords in the reverse. They wanted this man to be stuck in illusions. Confused. Yeah, so that this man would never walk away from them because they were misguided. They were being misguided. So, they wanted this man. And we got Empress and Queen of Wands here. Yup. Holding on. Rebirth. I'm getting like this. This is all because a man wanted to be with an Empress. A Queen of Cups energy. Or, one that, or like had real feelings and emotions for a person. Eight of, eight of Cups coming out. Somebody wanted to misguide this man or make this man feel misguided about this empress. Slash queen. Like they wanted this man to feel like this woman is not a real empress, not a queen of cups energy. They wanted to put this man in illusions here. This man, this man knows this. Whether you could be this Scorpio or this damn Scorpio gonna get dragged in the court. Yeah, somebody coming out of Hermit. Somebody's coming out this Hermit energy. You can have a Scorpio highly aspected in your chart. You can have Pisces highly aspected in your chart. Somebody's coming out this Hermit energy. Y'all presented some type of offer. Let's get something else and we're going to close it out. Because I didn't want this to be a super long read. Oh, what's going on? Not giving no energy. Yeah, to this woman who they do not like here. And this woman is unhappy. She pissed off. She in her feelings. <coughs> mm -hmm. Doing some type of research. Somebody's trying to strategize, but it's inconsistent here. What type of inconsistent? Or this could be trying to beat, trying to get somebody. I'm here to beat you at your own game. Trying to get somebody to be inconsistent about this offer. This woman is trying to figure out how she can get this man to be inconsistent about an offer. Or how she can get you to be inconsistent by accepting an offer from a man. Girl. Somebody at their wits ends here. Somebody's coming out of the cold, though. Boy, this rebirth is happening. Somebody's holding on. Secret conversation. Or somebody's being very secretive about a conversation. Somebody's making some type of choice to block something here. Not taking a leap of faith. Somebody don't see some coming. Somebody's determined to keep somebody out of love. With the world. Holding on. Somebody's holding on to a secret. <coughs> Somebody's holding on to a secret. hearing that they're a devil worshiper so are are whether it's that they're a devil worshiper or this person that's holding on to a secret is a devil worshiper 
somebody's holding on. Because we got eight of wands. There's a conversation here. A choice to block something. I'm hearing the reasons. The reasons that we're here. I'm getting like the whole reason for all this shit. Somebody's holding on to the whole real reason for all this. The devil. The motherfucking devil with the imprint in reverse. Somebody wanted to bond this man. That is the whole reason for all this. That somebody is part of a, a I'm here Ku Klux Klan, okay? I don't need no shit from nobody. It's Black History Month. Uh, Ku Klux Klan. And I'm getting like, shit, even if it wasn't Black Mystery Month. Them, don't get me started, because my ancestors are like, even if it wasn't Black History Month. But don't get me started. <laughs> anyway. I'm hearing like a group, a society of like, hated, or people that hate, I'm hearing hatred for men or something. I don't know, or this, this, she bond with people that hate men or something. I don't know, or she just didn't like this man. Um, or they just didn't like this man. They wanted this man to be the emperor in reverse. Bind this man to the devil here. And I'm going to just clarify for you all. What is the emperor in reverse? Emperor in reverse. And I'm, I just clarified it. I, I got to make shit up. I just clarified it. Ace of Swords, emperor in reverse. That's the emperor in the upright. It's coming upside down. Emperor in reverse. They wanted this man to be an emperor in reverse, and it's coming upside down because it's like something that you didn't know. I feel like you didn't know. Nobody know. No, they wanted this man to stay stuck. They didn't want this. They wanted this man to stay stuck and stagnant. They never wanted this man to progress. That was the whole point of all this shit. They never wanted this man to progress. They never wanted this man to see his full potential. They never wanted this man to be happy. They never wanted this man to blossom, to prosper, to be happy in life. Goodness, this is so weird. Like, they didn't want this man to be his full potential. Like, if somebody's meant to <coughs> be the fucking president, it's like, oh, I'm going to keep you in the hood because I know you're going to be the president one day. Type of weird shit. I know you got the potential to be a lawyer, a doctor, a CEO. Man, I can't make it up. Three of Wands. I'm getting like this man breaking out this shit anyways, and he's going to be that. He's going to be that doctor, that entrepreneur, that CEO, that president. Whatever the fuck God, God you know, spiritual advisor, whatever the fuck God has planned for this individual. Six of Cups. Somebody else wants to apologize about the past, okay? My <laughs> first slide that in there. And that person also want, um, want to ace the cups. They want to apologize about the past. Y'all, I'm sweating. I got to go. I'm sweating, man. They want to apologize about stuff that happened in the past here. I feel like this is this man, Three of Wands, uh, about them being the emperor in reverse. This man definitely could have been the emperor in reverse. Yeah, Page of Cups. And they were unapologetic. So, at some point, this man was the emperor in reverse, and they were unapologetic. They didn't have no concern. They didn't give no fuck about being the emperor in reverse. They just did not give a fuck. But now, this man is, he's apologizing. Because we got the page of cups coming out in the upright, but it's coming out upside down. Okay, that's in the reverse. It's coming up in the upright and the upside down. Meaning, like, you don't know this, but yeah, this man wants to come and apologize for stuff that happens in the past. Literally, on this you see him breaking her that car that that fucking page of cups okay this is like hi it's not like a whole i'm so sorry but this is more like oh don't chew my head off i'm so sorry you know what i just can i can i talk to you for a minute excuse me i'm sorry i'm here excuse me miss i saw you from across the room somebody wants to be like oh i'm, I'm sorry i just I know that the shit that I said, the shit that I had done, the shit that the person that I was was not me. I, I extremely apologize. Like, I'm so sorry. I, I didn't even mean to do this. And I'm also getting, like, here. I don't know why somebody could want to give you money or a present or something. Like, here you go. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry about what I said. I'm sorry about what I did. Here you go. And I'm getting, like, this person not going to have, like, a lot of ego about it. Queen of Swords. Y'all on that ass. You on that ass. 
you like, huh? Yeah, I apologize for what? Uh, uh speak a little louder. Ah, uh, everybody in the motherfucking universe better hear you. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> You like everybody in the universe need to hear you. Oh, no, what you whispering for now? Uh-uh, get down on your knees. Get down on your knees. Don't kiss my big toes. Look, I'm just playing. <laughs> Let me stop doing too much. But some of y'all, you really is like that a little bit. You like a little bit. You like shit. Because the, the pain and the... They could have really hurt your feelings a lot of the times. But look, navel wands come out in reverse. I feel like this person not coming with no bullshit. They're not coming with that, I'm um, too sexy for my shirt. They ain't coming with that energy. They're not coming with that naive of playing our jokester, our bullshit ass energy. It's in the reverse. I Meaning, like, this person is for real. They might just kiss your fucking big toe. Somebody like, I'll suck it if you want me to. Shit, you got clean feet or something like that. You get your toes done or something like that. They like, shit, baby, I know you clean or something like that. So this person want to get freaky with you. <laughs> I wanna get freaky with you. Look, they been sneaky about it. How they know? Cause you queen of swords. <laughs> they been sneaky about it. Cause you the queen of swords. They like, hold on, I gotta, <clears throat> I gotta catch them off guard a little bit. What's this? Two wands coming out. Two wands coming out in the reverse, coming upside down. <clears throat> I'm getting like this person should just be honest. Yeah, Knight of Wands. They're indecisive about it because they know they got to come and have this Eight of Wands, this conversation with you. So they kind of want to get that out the way. Excuse me. They kind of want to get that out the way. Hermit. This person's coming out um, a hermit. This person's coming out of hermit about the past, about the Ten of Swords, about everything. I'm getting like, this person's going to spill the beans about shit that had happened to them, shit about you. Then they also... With that Nine of Wands and with that, that Seven of Swords, this is giving me an energy of like they want a relationship with you, they want more with you, but they know you're very strategic towards them. And they also don't want to seem like they're making excuses. Like this person don't want to be like, oh yeah, it was the magic, they was putting magic on me or they was doing this to me. And you're going to be like, yeah, fuck off, you making excuses. So they also don't want to seem like they're making excuses. They just want to be real. Um, this person feels like they weren't healed. They know that. They feel like they weren't healed, okay? Four of Swords coming out of the first. They were a part of some type of bondage here, some type of bondage, marriage, or connection with that Four of Wands coming out in the reverse again. Somebody wasn't happy. They weren't happy with themselves. They weren't happy with the things that was happening around them. And my nose is itching. So that is all I have for you, my Pisces family. Thanks for chilling with your girl. I appreciate all the love and support you guys show to the channel. Thank you so very much, my babies. And if this video has touched you energetically any kind of way, definitely go ahead and give your girl a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button and notification bell. And I will definitely catch you guys in the next ones. Appreciate all the love and support, my babies. Peace, love, and prosperity. Till next time. Happy Valentine's Day. Bye.